Hi everyone, I'm hopeful that all you will be fine. In today's session, we will learn how you can actually integrate the Zoom Web SDK with the ViewChase. Okay, so for that, I have already created a meeting SDK app on a marketplace.zoom.us where from we can get the SDK key and SDK secret. Okay, so now let's start. First, we need to create the app from scratch. So for that, I have already opened the terminal. Now just need to type the command view create and we name the app called Zoom Web SDK View. Hit enter. And we will wait until it will be created. Okay, app is successfully generated. Now navigate to the VS Code. We are inside the Zoom Web SDK slash view folder. And you can see currently this app is generated uh, using the view 3. Okay, but the thing is that currently web sdk is only supporting the view 2 okay so current version of web sdk is 2.9.5 and it is only supportable with view 2 and if you are using view 3 then you will face problems okay so for that we first need to reduce the version so we need to set 2.7.14 need to save this we need to delete the node.js packages we need to install those once again, so we say yarn install. We will wait until package is installed. Okay, packages are installed. Now need to install the Zoom Web SDK package. So we say Zoom US slash Web SDK. The package will be installed. We need to create a component inside the components. We name it meeting dot view. Inside that, the package is installed successfully. We need to create the template. We need to place the placeholder. And here we need to place a script. And now we need to import the SDK. So import zoom mtj from zoom web SDK. Okay. Need to save and we need to change the app at root component to meeting. We need to import the meeting component need to change the path and we say components meeting save this need to start the app so we say yarn run serve we will wait until app will be built it we will face i think the console will show uh, error regarding the lint es lint we will disable that okay so we need to disable that by placing this command and now we need to navigate to the local host here we need to see that all the things are working fine till now now we need to export the component export default here we place the data inside the data we need to return the payload we will set that payload later okay and we also need to create the methods inside the methods we will uh, create method called join meeting we pass the payload okay and we need to bind the created okay here we need to call this join meeting we need to pass this parameter as a payload and here we need to configure the meeting sdk okay so first we need to configure the set lib path js lib path so we say https slash source dot zoom dot us slash lib and we say it slash av audio video and we need to preload web assembly we need to prepare web sdk all those functions to set up the SDK and now we need to generate the signature okay for signature generation all that payload and things will be must be on your server side I'm just for this demonstration purpose I am generating those directly here okay so zoom generates SDK signature inside that we need to use the uh, inside we need to set the SDK key and we get the SDK key from the payload. We also need to set the SDK secret. Get that from payload. 
and we also need to pass the meeting number we will get that from payload we need to set the role we will get that from payload okay and now we just need to bind success and here is a signature and we also need to bind the error function error and we need to console that error okay here inside the success we need to call the uh, init to initialize the stk before join so inside the in it we need to pass a leave url leave url is a mandatory option we must be need to pass that okay so we say it payload dot leave url and then we need to bind success inside the success we need to console dot log data and we need to call join function so we say join to mtj dot join and we need to save the meeting number we get the meeting number from payload we need to pass the stk key we will get that from payload also so we say stk key and we need to pass username we get that from the payload and we need to set the user email we get that from payload okay and we also need to pass the signature we get the signature from signature dot result okay and we set the token we will need to set for now empty string and here we need to bind the success we say data console.log and data we need to bind the error for the join and for the init okay so we say error function error log console.log error we said join error and here we need to pass the error object okay and inside the init we also need to bind the error so here we say error function error we need to console.log we say init error okay we pass the error object save this this uh, semicolon here and we need to build the payload here so here we say stk key we will get that from marketplace also we need secret we will get that from marketplace and we need to uh, get the we have also missed a parameter called password so we save that password here okay so we say password payload.password we also need to create here meeting number okay and we will get that from meeting tape from zoom.us slash meeting okay and password we will get also from the meeting tape meeting and we need to pass username i'm just setting learn with nick okay and we need to pass user email i'm setting nothing empty string user email is only required when you are a hosting going to host the meeting okay that means where when the role is one then email is required okay and then we need to set the role then we need to set the role i'm setting zero for join only and i think all the parameters are there stk secret meeting number password username email and role we need to format we need to navigate to the marketplace get the credentials copy the stk key place that here navigate back copy the secret paste it here and we need to navigate to the meeting tab zoom.us slash meeting inside that we need to schedule a test meeting generate save we need to get copy the meeting id from the url and paste it here get the meeting passcode copy paste okay and all done i think uh, always be a multi word so it is just mentioning some ESLint error 
so it is name the error inside the name okay oh we need to pass the name so here we say zoom if stick it okay save and all sorted okay now just navigate to the browser we need to close this browser now just open once again need to open the console so we can see if there is any error console and we are facing some error so it is mentioning that create app is not a function so basically there's a view error so we need to pass the view and here we need to remove the mount we need to call new and view save now just reload oh we are facing some problem we need to lock the payload i'm pretty sure that payload is not getting there so it is payload we are missing something or oh, leave url we have not set that leave url okay so we said that leave url also i'm going to say that to local host and that is 80 82 save now just reload okay boom we are successfully inside the join tab click on allow join you can see meeting is not started we need to first start the meeting okay so you click on start launch join from browser and now just reload the page so we need to reload here we need to click on join okay you are seeing we are successfully joined but we are facing some styling issues now just resolve those issues by placing the web stk styles okay so navigate to the component and scroll down we need to place a style here we call it import okay and we need to place the urls or path so we say source.zoom.us slash the version number which is 2.9.5 css and bootstrap.css okay and we also need to import the second package which is http source.zoom.us slash 2.9.5 and css slash react select okay select dot cs save to format and now just navigate and reload you can see all already the style is loaded and all the things are properly managed you can see here okay so I'm hopeful that you have enjoyed the session. If you have any query regarding the session, then just please share your queries via the video comment section. Either you can share your queries and suggestions via my share contact details. And hopefully we will come back with another session. Take care. Bye-bye.